All right, headed up to Jay Mountain again. Like this a few months ago. I mean to get back to it to finish it. It's uh, kind of rainy and kind of neat last time, but it's pretty nice and sunny today. Uh, we'll get all the way to the summit this time. Uh, we'll get going. It's about 42 degrees out, so a nice and cool, brisk day. Looking forward to this. I'm gonna head up uh, Jay Mountain here. Just leaving the parking area. There's no real sign for it right at the beginning here. But being up here a few months ago, I know the trail register is right up here in the woods. Here we go, trail register. Sign in in case we get lost. All right, starting off on the trailhead. Nice easy trail. Not too tough. Nice easy start. Yeah, this is looking like a great day for this. October 8th, uh, early fall. Still a lot of leaves to change, so should get some good views up here. Beautiful up here in fall, that's for sure. Lucky to be able to get out here and there. Okay, we are uh, just about to the uh, bump on the side of a hill here. Out done with the moderate part. I can see up ahead uh, the main mountain there. Not sure how clear it is through the leaves here, but from right here, we'll be starting the steep part pretty soon. That little uh, shoulder part on the side of that hill was uh, 35 minutes in, 1.2 miles. So I'm making some progress. Uh, you know, the leaves fall like, like rain. But you get just the littlest breeze and get a lot of the leaves falling now. Beautiful trail here. Getting close to the top. Up two point two miles in now. Almost an hour. Thing you can't capture on a video the smell of the leaves here in fall it's the only time of the year you can get that one's breaking out through the clouds that warms it up a little bit just right and higher up there it's getting a little chilly. Alright, you're getting close to the summit. Maybe not the summit summit, but first lookout. Uh, 
Uh, here trail split. Keep going that way to the real summit or uh, up here we're gonna go uh, right up here and check out this overlook here. Take a little break. so far. One thing I didn't notice on my first hike up here a few months ago because it's all cloudy and rainy. There's another uh, part to this right here. I got to right where I am right now and thought that was it. But now I can see there's a higher rocky promontory right over here. This is freaking really awesome right here. Wow. This is cool. I thought the views from over there were awesome last time. not past peak for the fall colors yet that's good try this a point in October or it's over cool very cool I see there's a little squirrel don't worry about me keep eating your lunch here and get back on the main trail and move along. down that way. I see a side trail over here we're gonna check out real quick. Eh. Eh. Looks like one a lot of people think leads to something but everybody follows it and doesn't really go anywhere. Head back down the regular trail. So we're headed 
it over there. A cool ridge walk up along here. Check it out. I saw a trail. It looks like it goes down the other way also. See if these two trails meet up. Another yeah, trail probably comes out right here. From the looks of it. Let's see what kind of views we got up here. Wow. And this hike is just not failing to disappoint. So I don't get too close to the edge of this, but. I want to slip down there. Yeah, definitely cool, definitely awesome views along here. I would highly recommend this trail on a nice day, especially a nice fall day like this. There's where we start out with our first uh, overlook over there. Really awesome colors right now. Keep going along this ridge and up to that little peak there, and then up there to the main summit. Be careful right along here. Felt it necessary to build a little rock here and here. Can't beat this hike today. I don't know if I can say that enough, but it's just the perfect day out right now. Let's see what's over here. A little bit going up here. Remember this last time going that way, but I also remember finding a trail on the way back. So I'm check that out this time. Let the trail. 
trail goes up through there or down over here. We'll go check it out and see. Be one way is easier than the other. trail maybe so we came from along there get closer yeah go right up there It's a lot easier to fall when it's not raining now. This is where I made it to the last time I came up here. So close yet so far. I don't know what the rest of this is like, but it looks fun. minutes in so I'm between taking videos and pictures uh, first overlook way over there it's been an hour over here so I mean, like I said with a lot of pictures and videos and sightseeing along the way so good time enjoying the hike enjoying all these beautiful colors can't beat it definitely in the prime of a fall foliage season. Uh, wander around for a few seconds there to find the trail down off of here.
full body workout on this hike. Way to go here, so let's go straight up. That's the parts that make these things fun. Not the summit, but oh. 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 wow. A lot of fun. Head right over there to the summit. Impressive. No real discernible trail right here, but wander in the general direction and look for signs. Right down here, I see a couple little rock cairns. Let's go check those out. Maybe they're right, maybe they're wrong. Usually most hikers are pretty friendly and well-meaning. They probably went through trouble putting those there to help people out. Oh, yep, here's the trail too. One little three-foot section of trail they can make out. Now, don't go too fast. miss any turns. Oh yeah, it's a little steep. I'm gonna put this uh, camera up for a few on this one. Yeah, it took a little figuring out to get down that part.
we'll see. So I'll get to the summit first. Get rained on on the way down. It just goes around these cliffs or does go the other way. Go back there to that trail split. Take a left. And it ends in a scramble with a steep drop. Seems how I'm all by myself. No hiking partner with me. I'm gonna skip this scramble and try the other direction. Just to be safe. Okay, we tried the right trail. I'm gonna try left trail, which looks uh, like it's gonna be a lot easier. I'm trying to scramble up with potentially not so good scramble there. Oh yeah, this is the way. Should be a summit right up there. Kind of taking the easy way out up here. Man, I'm following the trail, but. Cool looking rock scrambles up here too. Oh, there's the summit. It's right here, fall summit. There to lift my leg up. Ah, game out. Made it to the summit. A thousand times better views along the way than there is at the at the summit here. I don't think there's any more to it, but check around here for a few minutes and see what's going on. Yeah, but I read there's a good uh, point over here on the other side. Wow. That's pretty nice. Over to Champlain Valley, over to Vermont. Mount Mansfield, Camel's Hump, all the other mountains over there in Vermont. Awesome hike. Also a day on this one to head back. See the rain coming down in the distance over there. Right over that way, so head down and we'll see maybe I'll get a little wet maybe I'll uh, just scrape by and stay dry come prepared though I got a couple extra shirts raincoat uh, nice uh, thermal mid layer throw on hat gloves got a little bit of everything just in case you never know this time of year so better safe than sorry all right, awesome. 
and call this a day and head on back. It's about three hours and 20 minutes up here. Uh, I wasn't taking a bunch of pictures and videos, so it's not long it takes to get back without doing all that. And uh, finding the right way to go. Which is right down here. <laughs> sure is a little tricky in spots, so gotta keep an eye out. This here is kind of steeper way to come down. A little more risky, but if you follow along that edge up there, find a way to come down through some little boulders over here. down right through this way which is a little easier and a little less risky if you ask me either way better be a little careful Probably the trickiest part of this hike was finding this little spot here to get down there. <sighs> that trail comes right along there. Oh yeah, once I put my camera way before, I was about to go down that way. Don't go down that way. Follow oh, that little path there. All right, on to the trailhead. Hope we can get through most of this fort. First dumping rain, maybe we'll get lucky and no rain. We'll see. I think after you go up a mountain, you just go back down, but it's not the case. There's a few little uh, bumps here. And we can truly go down. This one you climb both ways. Bonus. Yeah, awesome hike this one. You, know, you gotta go uphill both ways. Almost done with the ups and downs. We're gonna go way down there and then up over that along the ridge and then down and we'll be done. Alrighty, here we are back at that truck. Signed out in the truck register. We got five hours, 57 minutes all together. It's not bad, I was planning on six. I'm pretty much right on time. Great day, all the little uh, rain I saw in the distance moving this way kind of went all around me. So that was awesome. And yeah, just over 10 miles all together with uh, some wandering around side trails and whatnot. So great day. Another awesome hike. Couldn't beat this weather today. It's really great. I'm going to take off now. A protein shake and something to eat. Uh, play on the next hike.
كيسحوا 